as part of your project, I know that you're going to be building this Captain America logo. And one of the things you need to do there is start with a star and keep the same center and draw a circle and another circle that's concentric to it, right? Now, in the method that you already know how to draw a circle, this is kind of tricky. It's possible, but tricky. So what I'm going to do is show you another way to think about a circle. Uh, it's slightly like it's a cheating way to do it. So let's do it. It's a hacky cheating way. So let's learn. So I'm going to go to a uh, smaller screen and bring the coding screen out. Let's do that. So and let's start writing code for a circle in method number two. Now, what is this method? So one way to look at a circle, right, is you have to go like this and draw a circle. I'll tell you what I mean. Okay, you have to draw like this drawing. That's how you're drawing a circle. Another way to look at a circle is, uh, what if I can go to the radius distance, some distance, put, a, put one dot, then come back here, then jump here, put one dot, then come back now, jump here, jump here, jump here. And if I keep doing this, if I keep putting these dots, after I keep jumping back, jump, jumping back, jump, jumping back, jump, I can actually draw a circle, right? That's just a totally different way to imagine the same problem. So I'm going to do that now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move forward by some distance, maybe uh, how much should I do? Like 75 pixels. Let's make it a large circle. And once I go there, I have to draw a dot. But instead of a dot, I'm going to move a little bit so that I can, it's almost a dot. How much shall I move by? Like, I don't know, some three pixels if I move. It's like, I'm just, you just see what I do now with this. Oh, see, I made a mistake. Uh, so my mistake was I did move forward. I don't want the line for the whole time, right? What do I want? I want him to just go there. So I have to jump forward. So let me replace the move forward with a jump forward. Jump forward by, uh, how much did I put? 75, right? 75. Now this should hopefully do what we want. Okay, perfect. I <laughs> hit the nuts. So the, can you see this tiny little dot here? That's what we've achieved. That is not a circle. But I know if I jump back again, where is this? Jump backward by the same 75. Can I do that? Oh no, right? That if I do that, I'll not go back to the same position. I actually want to go back to the center. Where did I start? I started here. I want to go exactly there, but I have jumped forward 75 and then gone ahead, moved forward another three. I've totally jumped 78. So I have to go back 78. I have to be careful. I keep making this mistake. Now I'll draw and come back. See, happily I came back. Now I need to draw the same dot somewhere close by over here on top and then keep doing it, right? Some number of times I'll get it, right? Let me first turn a little bit and then put it and see if my idea itself is correct. So let me turn by some, you know, 30 degrees, okay? And then if I do this, let's see what happens. Then if I have to do all of this again, I'm too lazy. I'm going to put a repeat block. Let me put a repeat of some, some number of times. Let's say, uh, because it's 30, you know, I'm going to put something like 12. Actually, not something like 12. There's a reason why I put 12 because I want to complete the full circle, right? 360 is the full circle, 30 is amount I'm turning. So if I'm turning by 30, I need to turn 12 times to complete and come back to position. So I'm just going to try that. Perfect. So I know I'm on the right track. So this is not a circle. This looks more like a clock. I've designed like the face of a clock, which is kind of nice. I kind of like, like how it looks. Uh, but if I want it to be more dense, then what can I do? I have to reduce the angle that I'm using, maybe 10 degrees. And how many times should I do this? 10? 36 times, right? 36 into 10 will give me 360. Let me try this again. No. Definitely better. I'm getting closer to a circle. So what I'm going to do is like do my classic one degree, 360 times and see if, you know, uh, this is, I think, as small as I can go here. Maybe I can go lesser, but let's see. Shall we try? So it's the point at which your angle is so, I don't know if you can hear me. Let me, let me wait, I think the noise will be done. I wish I could run this faster. I feel like the computer is doing all the grunt work for me. Whew. I don't know about you, I felt tired watching. I feel like I'm overworking this, this little guy over here. But we did get the circle. Now it's kind of wide if you notice, right? It's a kind of thick circle. Now I want you to think about what all you can change over here. You can change how large the circle is by increasing, this is basically the radius, right? The radius is how the distance from the center to the edge here. If I change that, uh, I'm a little uh, scared to do this again because it's going to take some time. I want you to try that. And I'm going to change two things, so do you know that? That's 100. Let's see if it makes a larger circle. Oh no, I did something. 
What did I do? I changed this by 100, made this 3, but I jumped back only by 78. That won't work. I have to make sure that I jump back by the right amount, 103. If I jump back by 103, this should work. Okay, gonna pause that. You know that the circle is gonna be drawn. Hopefully you trust me. If you want to change the width of the circle, you can try changing this one. How far, how far do you want to go there? And there it is. Now think about how you can draw two concentric circles using the same idea. And that'll be fun. And also realize that in this circle, it's not really a circle. Uh, because it's really close, you're joining there, jumping back and drawing, there might be a gap. If you make the circle really big, you'll start getting gaps there. So when that happens, you might have to make the angle even lesser than one degree, right? Think about it, have fun. I love drawing the circle this way, so I'm just gonna let this run with like, end the video with just this drawing like a thinner circle and then finish it. Maybe draw a large circle and then close it. 150. Oh no! I never learn. And that's it. Bye-bye.